In July 2013, Peachtree ventured into a new category with the release of the original Deep Blue, an all-in-one speaker system with Bluetooth technology. Now, almost five years later, we were lucky enough to get one of their very first production pieces of their brand new and highly anticipated Deep Blue 3, which we will be reviewing today. As we mentioned before, the Deep Blue 3 is the latest iteration in Peachtree's critically acclaimed Deep Blue series. It has a gray body with a black mesh metal grille. Some gray accents on the front give it an interesting look and include the Peachtree Audio logo and Deep Blue 3 name badge on the front. The top of the unit features five capacitive buttons that include power on and off, volume control, Bluetooth select, and other input select. Five small blue indicator LEDs line the top of the front grille, providing information such as volume level. In the box, you'll find all of the connections that you need, including an optical cable, RCA to mini cord, standard aux cable, a power cord, and a small handheld remote. You can turn the unit on and off, adjust the volume, adjust the bass levels, and even switch to the auxiliary input, optical input, or Bluetooth, all right from your remote. On the back, you will find a recessed handle, which makes it easy to pick up your Deep Blue 3 and move it from location to location. When lifting it, you'll quickly become aware of its heft, weighing in just around 16 pounds. The Deep Blue 3 is known for its deep bass, and good bass typically requires two things, a good-sized bass driver and a decent-sized cabinet. The Deep Blue 3 has both, with a 6.5-inch bass driver and a well-braced, acoustically-sealed cabinet measuring 14 inches wide, 9 inches high, and nearly 6.5 inches deep. The woofer is far larger than what you find in most all-in-one systems, and includes a massive magnet, which contributes to the weight of the speaker. The Deep Blue 3 also includes two 3-inch mid-range drivers, giving it some great response for the critical mid-range frequencies, along with two 1-inch soft dome tweeters for the highs. The total amp power is 440 watts, with each driver having its own amplifier. The Deep Blue 3 also includes a feature called Smart Volume. This adds some bottom end fullness when you're listening at low volumes and slightly rolls off the audio peaks at high volume levels, allowing the speakers to play loudly for hours without strain and distortion. We were really impressed with the Bluetooth capabilities on the Deep Blue 3. We easily set it up in about 10 seconds. For testing the connectivity, we walked out of the room, down the hall, and into another room with no dropouts. We could even control the volume from the other room. Playing the Deep Blue 3, the speaker produced clean bass without any muddy detail, and the voices and instruments are very well separated. It really puts out a lot of sound while still maintaining great quality. The Deep Blue 3 is perfect for anyone who wants an all-in-one system that sounds great but can easily be moved from room to room. It is designed to fill up a typical room at a modest price without taking up a ton of space. You could even add a TV or a turntable, assuming that you have a phono stage or a table with one built in. Whether the Deep Blue 3 is going to be your first major upgrade from the world of inexpensive Bluetooth speakers or a secondary system for an office, kitchen, or back porch, you won't be disappointed. The Deep Blue 3 is available for purchase on audioadvice.com. Link is in the description. And if you found this review helpful, please like it and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more original content. Thanks for watching. Thank you.